28-year-old accused of murdering a young actress. Danielle Bartelt's, Bartlett, Bartelt's murder trial started in West Bend today. He's accused of killing Jesse Blodgett. Michelle Fiore live at the Washington County Courthouse where a jury selection is underway. Michelle. Carol, when we first arrived, we found Jesse Blodgett's parents in the hallway. Asked how they're doing, they said okay, but their faces express, expressed what you'd expect to find from someone who'd lost their only child to something so heinous. This is Jesse Blodgett, just 19 years old, a musician who had just finished her first year at UW-Milwaukee. This is the man on trial for killing her. Daniel Bartelt was a family friend who once dated Jesse's friend. He looked like any other 20-year-old young man in court today, smiling when attorneys made jokes. But for Jesse's family, there is nothing to laugh about. Jesse's mother came home from lunch last July and found her daughter strangled to death in her bed. In the days that followed, police zeroed in on Bartelt as a suspect. Potential jurors were asked if they heard the media coverage. And was this uh, TV or newsprint? Okay, did you read an article in the Daily News? Anything since then? Bartelt was also a suspect in an attack at a Richfield Park on a woman walking her dog. Details of that were included in this criminal complaint, but the judge decided to focus this trial solely on Jesse's murder. That came into question, however, when one juror said he'd heard of the other case. I can't presume that this juror would share this information with the other jurors in the course of deliberating about whether Mr. Bartelt is guilty or not guilty. The jury pool started with about 70 people. Only 12 plus two alternates are needed. And over and over, potential jurors were advised to put aside what they've learned in the media and only focus on what they learn in court. This trial is expected to take about two weeks. Live in Washington County, Michelle Fiore, today's TMJ4. And of course, we'll keep everybody updated. Thank you, Michelle.